Hey guys, my name is Vivek Neupane and I am an engineering student. I am on my second semester. So this was my project of my second semester and I actually made a bank management system by using Visual C++ and for this I used Visual Studio 2013 and my SQL server for my database management system. So this is my code and I am gonna execute this local window debugger. So it's going to run my program and here is my project. So this was my project. This is my first form which is going to say please enter your username and passport username passport there are two text box of verify button and create new account button so if i'm going to click the create new account button so it's going to say i have to input my first name last name address contact number username passport gender which combo box male and female and you can verify and create your account right here since i have already created my account so i'm going to write here my account which I have already created V I V E K which is my username and passport B A N K and here is a asterisk for my privacy. So I'm gonna verify credential. So it's gonna give me a message box username and passport is correct and even I know that so thank you very much. So here is another form which is gonna say view current status deposit and withdraw amount display date and time convert money. So since you need to since you are using an application in your mobile or laptop and you just are confused you don't have a watch and you are really confused about coordinate and time and you need to know that whether it's the correct time for depositing or withdrawing any amount then you can easily click to this button and just display the date and time so it's going to it's going to display you the date and time right here so and in case if you are a little bit dumb like me and you just don't know how to what how the currency is running right here so you can go up to here convert money here's a nepal's flag let's convert unit of measurement to be converted from to select an option so i'm gonna select an option right here first of all i'm gonna show a little magic so here is nothing so i'm gonna select an option like dollar to rupee so here is dollar automatically signed up here rupee automatically signed and then converting from dollar to rupee so i'm gonna just move this scroll bar a bit like this so one dollar equals to 106 rupees which is going to make you easier to you know transition of money uh, so this is for your this is for you just to make easy while using this application so here here is the main button which is going to say deposit and withdraw amount this was my main focus and the main priority of my project so i'm going to click this button then it's going to say let's play with money so here is a dollar and your deposited amount in bank was this which i already deposited so here is deposit amount tax box withdraw amount tax box and i'm going to put how much amount i want to deposit or how much amount i i want to withdraw through this and it's going to show my your current balance is in rupees so i'm going to deposit five one two three four which is 50,000 so deposit buddy your amount will be deposit and added to your bank account of course okay so you have just deposited RS 50,000 to your bank and I'm going to cancel this I already know that so here is your deposit amount in bank was 10 lakhs and 50,000 which is kind of magic isn't it so this was actually the project that i made through visual c plus plus i hope you got you guys actually like this like my project and if you really like this and you want to make this it's quite simple using a visual studio and my sql server so you can you can make it if you are if you want any help or any kind of you know suggestion about how to make the program like this then you can just subscribe my video and you just can comment the you know what you want to make and what help you really need from me so I'm always there to help